What's up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music. We've got another cool countdown for you guys. Thanks again for the continued support. We couldn't do it without you. When you think of guitar gods, it's easy to simply reminisce on the best lead electric guitarists that we've heard over the last few decades. But some of the greatest guitarists out there are predominantly acoustic players. And many of these players are pioneers in their respective genres. So get ready to chill while we count down some of the best acoustic guitar players that are out there. Let's get to it. James Taylor. Possibly one of the greatest singer-songwriters of all time, James Taylor certainly knows his way around an acoustic guitar. Some of his greatest songs can attribute a fair amount of their success to Taylor's ability to craft tasteful lead licks. Even though Taylor is known for these beautiful songs, he's still one of the greatest finger pickers to ever make his way into the mainstream. Stephen Stills. Another amazing songwriter, Stephen Stills is an often unsung hero of the guitar world. During his heyday, Stills earned the respect of many legendary guitarists, including Jimi Hendrix. And many of Crosby, Stills & Nash's most successful songs are noteworthy because of Stills' skills on acoustic guitar. Michael Hedges. Hedges may be one of the most musically accomplished guitarists on our list. His use of harmonic slaps, hammer-ons, alternative tunings, and a whole host of other techniques added a totally new vocabulary of sounds to the acoustic guitar. When I hear Michael play, I always wonder how all those tones can come from one man playing guitar. Bob Dylan. Bob Dylan single-handedly revolutionized folk music. His lyrical abilities and performances are almost effortless, and his guitar playing is no exception. Dylan made the most of different picking patterns and open tunings, allowing him to craft some of the catchiest licks in folk music. He used the techniques he learned from other folk, jazz, and blues musicians to create a style that is completely his own. Robert Johnson. You may not know who Robert Johnson is, but you've definitely heard elements of his music, given the fact he's influenced almost every guitarist in the modern era. A pioneer of the Delta Blues, Johnson refined the techniques of other Southern blues players of the time. And if the few recordings we have of him didn't exist, 20th century rock and music in general would sound very different. Chet Atkins. Chet Atkins took fingerstyle guitar picking to a new level. As a session player in Nashville, Chet would often play a bass line with his thumb and pick the melody and harmony of a song with the remaining four fingers. This effortless dexterity influenced some of the most legendary guitarists out there, including George Harrison and Eric Clapton. His influence endures today and can be heard through modern country guitar gods like Keith Urban and Brad Paisley. Tommy Emmanuel. Tommy Emmanuel is an acoustic virtuoso from Australia. He worshiped Chet Atkins growing up playing guitar. He eventually got to actually record with Chet Atkins, but he also took that style to the next level. Whether it's the famous Travis picking, it's amazing, but he's also proficient in jazz, blues, and even classical styles. Tommy Emmanuel's groove and proficiency on the instrument has to be seen to believe. You gotta go check him out. Who are your favorite acoustic guitarists not named Jack Johnson? Are there ones we didn't discuss that you think should be on this list? Let us know in the comments section below. And while you're down there, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks again for watching and we'll see you real soon.